Top five stories you need to know about this Tuesday morning. Butte County has one of the highest overdose death rates in the state. Diego Moctezuma joins us live with details about a new program local health agencies hope will put an end to that trend. Butte County public health officials say they are, they are seeing more opioid overdose deaths each year. Butte County has the 10th highest rate for opioid overdose deaths in the state. That's why they're, they are saying the COPE program is more important now than ever. It stands for Community Overdose Prevention Effort, and its goal is to drop the number of deaths from opioids. Naloxone is just one of the efforts they are encouraging you to have and know about in case of an overdose emergency. Back to you. New details. Police in Chico say one adult and four underage suspects were arrested in connection to a robbery in Chico involving nine to ten suspects. Chico police say 18 year old Trayvon Nakari and at least eight others robbed a person around third and Wall Streets around seven last night. Eight people in all were detained and one to two are still on the loose. Police say no one was hurt. They're still looking for the final two people. Nakari was charged for being in possession of a loaded gun and obstructing an officer. They're not releasing the names of the underage suspects or the name of the victim. Happening today, an update on this year's budget in Shasta County. The Board of Supervisors are adopting budget adjustments for several departments and looking ahead at next year's proposed budget. They'll also consider a request for six public safety officers at the Shasta County Jail and consider a request from Supervisor Cry to lower the notary license fees, which he says are the highest in California. Today in Glen County, the Board of Supervisors is expected to ratify a local emergency proclamation. This after the bitter storms in mid-February caused damage. Here's a look at the flooding last week from the Glen County Sheriff's Office. They sent video by drone showing the significant flooding on County Road 61. And also on that Glen County agenda, broadband feasibility in Glen County. The board will hear a presentation from the county administration about the cost, benefits, and where the money will come from. And today, the Reading Planning Commission holds a public hearing on the updated General Plan 2045.